can still do a lot of things. But since this spring, I can't raise my uh, right arm very high. Insurance guy told me today that not all chiropractors' office decide decided to take the uh, insurance that they offer. So he's blaming my chiropractor. He says is her his chiropractor too for not taking uh, their insurance. And so that's why my chiropractor didn't get paid. I think it's a lame ass excuse. Anyway, I got two up there. I got one up there. I thought I had two up there. I sat down. Second one was down there on the floor. I put it back up there. I screamed and panicked and was sure that one of the kittens eating on the rug in the bowl would reach for it. No one did. I was so happy because so many older ones, like my Sophie and Mr. Boots, who we lost, uh, I had seen them racing through the trailer with the uh, A uh, horrible fly crappy thing clinging to them. Someone else just recently did it. Who was it? I think it was Ling Ling. She's not in here. She's waiting for us to bring supper. And it's Kitty Crunchies. And it's in there. And I'll take it in there. And I'll put up a couple more tomorrow. But, you know... That's like seven, that is seven feet tall because I was six, now I'm 5'11. And so, um, it's not easy. And if you want to argue with me, you become 65, you have only one arm to reach with, and you do it. That is Sophie's mama, Emily. Everybody's cuddling with mommies. It's nap time. It's time to go to bed. So I'm going to go to bed. Feed the kitties, eat the peaches in my pocket, and drink some iced tea. It's not tea yet. It's frozen chunk of ice. But I have high hopes that it will melt fast because it's hot in here. It's supposed to be six degrees hotter tomorrow and the first of the week is supposed to be in the 90s because this is global warming people who do not understand the subject or the concept of global warming and I have to put Lulu's collar on someone else I thought I'd put it on to Sadie who's over there her collar is falling apart I guess I'll put it in the drawer with my mom and dad until I get home tomorrow. Anyway, look at my beautiful kitty. He's on my coat, my sweatshirt. I put it there so that they can have something comfortable to sleep on. They'll follow me into the back bedroom. But, you know, they have the choice to stay in here. <sighs> There's a couple of the fly strips just saturated with flies. I don't like to take them down until every little bit is used because they're so dear. Dear means not that it's precious, but that sometimes it's hard to come by. So, you all have a blessed night and a safe weekend. Take care. From Val and the kitties. Have a great safe time.
Ho, ho, Emily, Emily, you can't do that. You're not a baby anymore. Get down here where it's safe. Come on, sweetheart. Nice try, though, Emily. And the crowd goes wild. Come on, you can get up there. Jump, Emily. Go on. Wow, 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 wow. And you were here to see it? Woohoo! Emily. I guess that's all the show we get. Sophie can jump straight up and be on, the, on top of that. I don't think she wants to tonight. The kittens haven't figured that out yet. Have a good night.